Welcome to Benjamin Obdike's Test House. Today we're going to review our UV protected open joint rain screen installed with our Invisirap UV, our Batten UV, and our Hydroflash UV Plus. With the installation of Invisirap, it is critical to make sure that we understand that it's our water control layer, but also we're going to be able to see this through these open joint spaces. So we want to take a look at the fastener location to a higher standard than a conventional wrap. So with this, we actually want to try to hide as many of these cap fasteners behind our overlaps or behind our batten strips that we're going to put on for the installation of our cladding. And when we're doing this, we want to use as many chalk lines as possible. So if you can see here, we have a red chalk line that we put directly on our sheathing before the first course. So that's gonna ensure that we keep a nice straight product that is gonna prevent wrinkles and it also is gonna look really good between those open joints. With this installation, we are using our Invisirap as our UV control layer, and we are designating our sheathing as our air control. So we want to make sure that all of our seams and transitions from the bottom of our wall to our foundation are taped with our Hydroflash UV+. When installing Invisirap, it's important to make sure that we have the glossy, smooth side to the exterior. This has a polyester UV coating, which is the magic layer as far as the UV resistance. This can be confirmed by seeing the lot number that is printed about every 12 feet along the roll, just to make sure you have the right side facing out. Invisirap will be used as our water control layer, so we want to make sure that we tape all of the seams. So that's our vertical seams as well as our horizontal with our Hydroflash UV+. And in that, we also want to hide as many of the fasteners as possible. So when we are fastening at the edges, we want to keep the cap fastener close to the edge so that we can cover it with the, the seam tape. Our Batten UV can be installed in many different options. So we do have it installed horizontally at the bottom of the wall detail. This acts as a bug screen, as well as allows liquid water to drain through. Then we also have it installed vertically to mimic the stud locations. And this is a non-compressible batten that will allow airflow to circulate behind whichever open joint cladding you choose. Thank you for joining us at Benjamin Obdike's Test House, where we strive to help you build better.